In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a multiple choice question step by step. Let's get started. I first navigate to my question bank, which is where I can quickly find previously stored questions. To add a new question, I click the red plus button at the bottom right corner of the page. A list of question types appears. I select multiple choice question to proceed. Now I'm facing the multiple choice question editor, where I configure all the properties of the question. I'm writing an example question text. What is the capital city of France? Now I'll add the choices one by one, London. Paris. Tokyo. Istanbul. And Berlin. I will now mark the correct choice, in our case, the second option, Paris. I can preview how the question will function within a test by activating the preview mode and making a selection. I can then view how the system automatically grades the answer. Once my question is ready, I navigate to the folder tab to set up where the question will be stored within my question bank. Each question can be assigned to one folder and multiple tags, making it easy to find the right set of questions within the question bank. I will start by identifying the folder where the question will be stored. The system presents me with a list of existing folders. I can choose one of these or create a new one by simply writing a folder name. I will also flag this folder as a favorite, so that when I create subsequent questions, this folder will automatically be selected. I will further classify the question by adding tags such as topic geography. And difficulty easy. I will then save the question and demonstrate how to easily find it in the question bank using the designated folder and tags. To locate the question, I navigate to the question bank. Select the relevant folder. And select certain tags. By clicking the list questions button, the system displays all questions in the selected folder with the chosen tags. Test Invite is built to efficiently store a large number of questions while maintaining their organization. By properly classifying your questions, you can save time when creating tests as you will be able to quickly locate the appropriate set of questions when needed. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Sign up for a free account and practice creating and storing questions in your question bank.